What is going on all of you beautiful people? Hope you're having an amazing day. Today's Wednesday. I don't know how I got my days so mixed up and honestly I'm surprised that none of you corrected me. But I kept saying we're picking up the Savoy on the 15th which is Wednesday. But today's Wednesday and it's only the 14th. So I got mixed up a day, maybe an extra day. So today's the 14th, we're going to the junkyard today. Gotta make sure, I'm gonna check the books, make sure no one else has been on my car. Hopefully we're good to go. Um, and then, fingers crossed, no one has been on the car. If someone has been on the car, um, we'll increase our bid, but just fingers crossed no one has. And then tomorrow we go back and get the car, the 15th, which is actually a Thursday and not a Wednesday, which is today. I got mixed up, it happens. We are back to our favorite place, AKA the junkyard, and fingers crossed, no one else has been on my car. Alright, so here's the deal. Well, one, there's a beautiful R33 next to me. Beautiful car. But here's the deal. So, check the books. There's two other people that have bid on the Savoy, which is funny because that car has ran through, I think, two prior months. No one's bid on it. But of course, since I bid on the car, people got to bid on it. So, <clears throat> the question is now, what do I bid next? Now, very, they very well both may be at 350. I don't know their bids. Um, if they didn't see my name prior, or the number 17 on there, they may have bid 350 along with the person after that. Or if they saw my name and said, okay, I have to bid higher, they may be at 375, 380, 400. I have literally no idea. So I could possibly still win at 351 if they're both at 350, but if they went any higher, I obviously would have to go higher as well. But again, I don't know. So do I go 400, do I go 450, do I just leave it? Ah, uh, so many decisions. Okay, well, we've officially upped our bid to 451. Um, anything over that, they can have the car, but hopefully that's enough to seal it in. I don't know. I have no, I say, I have no idea what the uh, the last people bid. It could have been 350. It could be 351, 355. We have literally no idea. It could be a thousand dollars. I have no idea. So at this point, we. We just wait. Okay, the day is now Thursday. Good morning, everybody. It's been raining all day, but today's the day we find out if we got the Savoy or not. Um, they'll be calling the person who won, but I don't have a phone, so they can't call me. So I have to go buy the junk card at some point today and just see if I got it. Um, it's only like 9.15 now. There's been no internet in the house since Tuesday. That's why there's been no videos, and I haven't been vlogging because I can't do anything. So um, I'm going to head to the library right now, try and get back on the internet for a little while because I've been selling a bunch of parts on Instagram. And then around 11.30 or so, we'll head to the junk card and see if we got the car. Fingers crossed. I don't know what the other bids were. I bid 451. We'll see. We'll see. It's going to be a very interesting day. I hope this rain stops. Okay, here's the update for right now. It's currently a little after 1 o'clock. Uh, I've been at the library for like three hours now trying to get some stuff done because I have no internet at home. I was informed we won't have Wi-Fi at home until Tuesday of next week. So a full week without internet, which really, really sucks because everything I do is on the internet and I have no phone right now. Um, I have to go to the BX real quick. Talk to TKS, see what's going on, or why it takes so long. If they refund us some money, and then also I have to go to the T-Mobile store and see if my SIM cards in yet because I can put that SIM card in this phone, which this phone sucks and only works on the charger at this point, which is super inconvenient. Um, but if I have service, that'd be nice because there's no Wi-Fi at home. Also, no phone calls yet, so I don't. I'm meaning to think I didn't win the Savoy, but I don't know. So I'm gonna go to the BX, then with the junk card, and see if we won. I don't think we did. I'm probably gonna call by now, but. Ah, it's turning into one of those days. Well, we're here, fingers crossed. Okay, well, turn of events. Apparently, I was understanding wrong. Um, the bidding ends today, not yesterday, and they call people tomorrow, which is the 16th, and that's it in the 15th. So I understood wrong, or was explained wrong. Either way, um, it doesn't end until the end of today, and then they call tomorrow. So I checked the books again. Uh, I'm still the last bid on the Savoy. So. We still might uh, be good to go. I was worried we hadn't gotten any phone calls, but it's not until tomorrow. So now we just wait another day. Yeah. Okay, good morning for like the fifth time. I think this is like a four day video at this point, but it's Friday morning, it's 11 o'clock. So we should finally hear back from the junkyard within the next hour or so, I'd say. But fingers crossed, the Savoy is ours. This has been such a long process. I've mixed up days and I understood things wrong, but 
Today should be the final day, and fingers crossed we're bringing home the Savoy today. Okay, I'm sorry that like this entire video is just about me talking. I, I apologize, I didn't want it to be this, but it's currently four o'clock in the afternoon. I've heard nothing, so I can only assume we didn't get the car, but I can't go to the junkyard yet to verify because I'm the only one home and they're supposed to bring our Wi-Fi modem today, um, sometime during the day, but if I'm not here, when they get here, they reschedule to Tuesday of next week, which would really suck to not have Wi-Fi for the entire weekend. It's already been like a week and it sucks. So I have to wait here until Casey gets home and then I can go check, but I'm almost positive we didn't get the car because she hasn't got any calls and neither have I, and it's been almost all day, so. Uh... And speaking of the wife, good timing. You know, it's kind of funny. It, it's my luck to bid on a car that's ran through two prior times and got no bids at all to this time having, I think, four total people bid on the car. Um, Casey actually went to the junkyard after work before we went to check on the car. Um, I actually didn't win the car. A guy bid 600 on it. Why? I don't know. But bid 600 bucks on the car. So I didn't win at 451. But. Um, if he, he hasn't answered his phone yet, they tried to call him and didn't answer his phone. So he has till six o'clock today, all day tomorrow, and then reopening the junkyard on Tuesday. So he still has like three days left to claim the car, which I'm sure he will. So it's almost 100% guaranteed. We won't get the Savoy, but there's still a slight chance, but I'm not gonna continue this video all at Tuesday of next week because that's just ridiculous. So we're gonna end it here. I'm sorry this video was a whole bunch of just like nothing, really. I mean, there's, there's a cinematic of the car in the beginning, but other than that, this is like literally nothing. I don't know, bidding on cars is really annoying. Probably my first and my last time. Like, well, bidding on cars, you can't know the price. That's very annoying. Not knowing if you're winning, losing, waiting, it, it really sucks. So, I don't know, we may have a Savoy by Tuesday if he doesn't pay for the car, which I'm, like I said, I'm pretty sure he will. But if not, then it goes to me if I then want the car, but I may look for something else. I don't know, it's been such a, it's been such a hassle. Either way, don't forget, be there for the day. We'll see you next time, peace.